प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू अवर चैनल एंड प्रेस बेल आइकॉन फॉर मोर अपडेट्स सपोर्ट एंड एजुकेशनल चैनल थैंक यू द डीएनए एज एन एसिडिक सब्सटेंस प्रेजेंट इन द न्यूक्लियस एंड रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द यूनिक कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म इट वॉज फर्स्ट आइडेंटिफाइड बाय फ्रेडरिक मेश इन 1869, he found it in white blood cells and named it as nuclein. Later, in 1953, James Watson and Francis Crick, they explained the structure of DNA based on the X-ray diffraction, and they proposed a very simple but famous double helix model for the structure of DNA. DNA acts as blueprint of an organism during cell division chromatin network present in the nucleus condenses into the chromosome chromosome is made up of double helix strands of dna the molecule of dna has a pair of polynucleotide chain which are running anti parallel to each other the nitrogenous bases acts as the strands of dna They are purines and pyrimidines. Both polynucleotide chain and nitrogenous bases they intertwine to each other to form a twisted ladder. They formed into a coil double helix model. Each polynucleotide chain of DNA has a series of nucleotide units. Each nucleotide unit has three important components. namely deoxyribose sugar are also known as pentose sugar second one is phosphate group and nitrogenous base the deoxyribose sugar is also known as pentose sugar each strands of dna is made up of pentose sugar and a phosphate group which are arranged in alternative manner Here you can observe both pentose sugar and phosphate group they get attached together in an alternative manner A pentose sugar is linked to phosphate group through a phosphoester linkage to form a nucleotide and a nitrogenous base is linked to the pentose sugar through a N glycosidic bond Again the nitrogenous bases are of two types they are purines and pyrimidines purines are adenine and guanine pyrimidines are cytosine thymine and uracil uracil found in rna a purine base on one polynucleotide chain always pairs with a pyrimidine base on the other adenine pairs with the thymine and guanine pairs with the cytosine This is called complementary base pairing. Let us understand the double strands of DNA by this way. Here the two stripes are indicating the polynucleotide chain of DNA. Both polynucleotide chain of DNA are made by the pentose sugar and phosphate group. Another strand is also made by the sugar and phosphate group where are nitrogenous bases they are present in between them they get attached together by a hydrogen bond